Organic milk versus regular milk. How do you decide which to buy at the store? Maybe these facts will help you in making the smart choice. For milk to be labeled organic, the USDA has certain requirements according to the National Organic Program. Based on these regulations, here are some of the differences we find important. So what do organic cows eat? Their diet must consist of 30% dry matter intake from pasture grazed during the grazing season, which totals at least 120 days. And dry matter is what remains after all of the water is evaporated out of a feed. And the dry matter intake is important because it determines the amount of nutrients that's available to the cow and that helps maintain health and production. The organic dairy cows must be raised on 100% certified organic feed. Now the farmers feed cows organic barley, corn, and alfalfa. And the 100% organic feed includes all the ingredients, additives, and supplements that go into the feed. That includes grazing on certified organic pasture, grown without any herbicides, pesticides, or synthetic fertilizers. The organic feed may not come from genetically modified sources, and there can be no animal byproducts in the feed. And what do conventional cows eat? Feed is mainly silage, which is chopped fermented corn or barley mixed with other grains such as soybeans. Vitamins and minerals may also be added to the feed. The grains may be genetically modified and be treated with pesticides and synthetic fertilizers. Many conventional farms grow their own GMO feed corn for their dairy cows. The feed could also contain pig and chicken byproducts and these cows eat little to no fresh grass. According to the USDA regulations, organic cows cannot be given any antibiotics, while conventional cows may be treated with antibiotics. Every tanker of milk, whether from a conventional or an organic farm, is tested for antibiotics. The whole load will be discarded if it tests positive for commonly used antibiotics. Bovine growth hormone, or RBGH, is a genetically engineered protein growth hormone used to increase milk production by at least 10%. Organic cows are not given RBGH, while conventional cows may be injected with RBGH. The hormone is banned in Europe, Canada, Australia, New Zealand, and Japan. Milk from RBGH-treated cows may have higher levels of IGF-1, which is an insulin-like growth factor. Now, it's a normal growth factor, but excess levels may increase the risk of cancer in humans. The USDA's Access to Pasture Rule, published in 2010, sets pasture standards for organic livestock. Livestock must actively graze on a daily basis during the grazing season have access to the outdoors, and not be confined during the non-grazing season. On-site inspections are done annually to verify compliance with the organic regulations. On the other hand, there are no pasture requirements for conventional dairy farms. Cows have little or no access to the outdoors. They spend more time in barns with limited access to sunlight and fresh air. Now you have all the information you need to make a decision when buying milk. Please subscribe to our channel and visit bestorganicreviews.com for more info.